Hey my squidlings, it's Katie here. Welcome back to another unboxing video. Today we're going to be unboxing another creative art box. This is for the month of July 2017 and I actually have no idea what the theme is for this one uh, and I'm really <laughs> excited to be opening it. So if you're interested in a creative art box, it is $24 a month but you can upgrade for $5 more. You can get an extra supply in your box and that is called the Super Awesome Box. So basically creative art box gives you everything you're going to need in a box to do a project and it's for anybody of all skill levels and I think what they do is pretty awesome so uh, I do want to be transparent they did send this to me free for review um, but all opinions and stuff are my own and they're not being sponsored or anything so um, I'm still gonna give you guys my honest opinion so uh, before I get into the video if you want to order a creative art box you can actually use my code unboxing 717 before the end of July which is July 31st uh, to get 10% off anything in their store including past boxes which I think is awesome so and if you have it already and they have some left go check out the June box uh, I did an unboxing for that and I'll leave a card up here for that uh, it was a really great box and I really liked it so and the theme for that was journaling and it's four dollars off and then you can get 10% more off which is really great deal so um, let me stop jibbing jabbing talking yep that one uh, and let's just open it right up all right so things are flying at me I have no idea what this is so we've got a little sticker and it says creative at heart I love their stickers they're always so inspiring uh, and this is what I'm looking for so I don't want to see the list but uh, if you want to go ahead and read about the supplies I will leave this right here Ooh, it's a little long so you can pause and read here and you can pause and read here all right so because I want to be surprised so I don't want to look yet so first off we've got a couple of pieces of square paper and these are called oh lord I'm gonna butcher this name Hanemule you tangle art tiles uh here I'll show you there these ones right here the two Hanemule you tangle art tiles uh so that is what we're gonna be drawing on and I think I know what we're gonna be doing and I'm very excited because it's what I if it's what I think it is then that means this is something from my childhood that I absolutely love to do. This is a design ruler and I don't know if you guys remember those spirographs as a kid and they were the most fun thing in the whole world uh, but yeah this is what this is so you I'll, I'll demo it in the picture that I intend on making but basically you put your pin in one of these and you go round and around the circle and it makes these really cool designs that you can kind of see in the background and I'm so excited so this is the design ruler for that then we've got a wink of Luna brush pen ooh I have one of these in green and I like it so this is gonna be fun um, so this one is in violet and I will actually show you what it looks like and then I don't know if you can see that but it is shiny it's a metallic paint marker or it's a metallic brush pen and I really like these so I'm excited for this oh my goodness they spoiled us this month so the next thing we got is a bemoji oh this is by Kuritake I love Kuritake uh, it looks like a brush pen very excited for this I think this is called a fude pen Oh, this is so nice. So, my my lettering is really bad, so I apologize. So you can get really thick lines, or you can get thin lines. That's really nice. I like, they had a really nice selection in this box. Then we got three pins, so we're gonna look at this one first. This is a Jelly Roll Metallic, and it looks like it is pink. So let's see, is it already going yet? So this is a Sakura Jelly Roll. And it is metallic. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it is shiny. And then lastly, we've got two of these. These are a Maped Maped Graph Peps very interesting name uh, we got one in like a tealy turquoise ish blue and one in gray so I'm going to write some of it with this Ooh, it's a nice fine point I like I like these colors 
colors a lot. They match their lids pretty well. So I'm really happy with this box. Oh my goodness. So just to recap, we got the Wink of Luna, a purple brush pen. We got the Bemoji pen, which I intend on using a lot. Actually, I intend on using all of these a lot. A socket of jelly roll, metallic and pink, and then a, I assume it's Mayped, uh, Graph Peps in extra fine. Then we got this really cool design ruler to do some spirographing, and of course they give us paper, which is amazing. I didn't want to waste it, so I went ahead and used the journal from the other box to test all these items out. And yeah, I'm really excited. So doing the math, all of these items total up to $24, which I think is really amazing. So it's $24.19. So that means you get your money's worth. Yay. And you get some really awesome supplies. Honestly, uh, I have a Wink of Luna, but I've never heard of most of these aside from the Sakata company. So I'm really excited to just get to test other items out. This is just the awesome box. So if you order the super awesome box, you will get one additional item. And currently, I don't know what that is, but I will edit it into the video whenever I know what it is. It's probably going to be a great deal because I know last month's box was a really great deal. So I'm really excited to be doing this. So we're going to go ahead and get into an illustration. And I am going to play around with the spirographs on these small squares of paper. But I'm actually going to be doing a full illustration on another piece of paper. So you're going to get a few speed paints in one. So let's go head over and do that. So now I'm getting into the creation portion. First, I grabbed some printer paper because I wanted to kind of test to see some of the designs that I could get and also to kind of get used to this because I haven't done this kind of technique in a long time and you can tell because a lot of these are super messy and I had no idea what I was doing. <laughs> so I was playing with all of the different pins that I could use this with. Of course, the Bemoji brush pin and the Kuretake Wink of Luna would not really go well with this, so I had to use the, uh, the other pins. So I was just kind of playing around. One thing I thought was kind of annoying was the Sakura Jelly Roll pin. It decided to smear everywhere, but of course that was nobody's fault. Um, it just was smeary. So first, this was more of my practice piece because I already really knew what I wanted to do. So I decided to draw a girl and I was going to have her have some flowers around her, but I couldn't really get them small enough like the way I would want it. So um, I just kind of went with it. I tried to do the smallest flowers I could. Of course, uh, this pencil did not come in the box, but everything else I used in this picture was from this box. So uh, I just decided to just go with it, you know, make some flowers. I messed up a few times, but it wasn't a big deal. Um, all in all, I thought it was a lot of fun. And I think this box was a lot of fun. I don't know. It just brought me back to my childhood and it made me really happy. And I was just, I don't know, I was happy to do this project. So thank you Creative Art Box for providing it another amazing uh, box this month. And again, if you're interested in getting a box, the August box is available, I believe, until August 1st. So check the link in the description and don't forget to use my code unboxing717 to get 10% off everything in their store until July 31st. Also, I have a sale in my store, half off every piece of art I have in my store until July 31st as well. So go head on to my store. I'll have a card on the screen and a link in the description below to where you can go check that out. And if you order something, I think I might throw these two originals in there just as a fun little bonus. So, uh, It'll be like a mystery. You won't know who gets it. So if you do get it, you should totally tag me on social media if you buy something and you get it. Because I would love to see... Anyway, uh, I decided to do a second kind of sideways shot for the second picture. Um, so I filmed on my phone and I thought it was a really cool idea. I'm, I'll still have to play around with the angle a little bit, but it was, I liked it. So anyway, this picture, I decided to do some flowers first or, you know, the spirograph little spiral things. Uh, and then I decided to have them like flowers in a flower pot and I thought it was a really cute idea. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Also, uh, so I used the Bemoji pen finally and then I finished off with coloring with the, uh, 
the Wink of Luna, which I think is absolutely gorgeous. It just adds a special sparkly shine to it and it just makes me really happy because yeah. So here is a final look at the last two pieces. Please don't forget to check Creative Art Box out. Use that code. It's a really great deal and they don't come around very often. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe here to a cute little squid pod if you haven't already to keep updated on new videos. So until next time guys, toodaloo!